What's up guys? In this video, we'll take a look at five plugins to complement your workflow in Ableton Live. Ableton comes with an amazing selection of stock plugins. These five make a great addition to your sessions and open up a ton of possibilities for the sonic palette in your mixes. Here's the before with the plugins bypassed. Lucy in the sky with diamond sunlight make it shine. Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side. And now with them on. Lucy in the sky with diamond sunlight make it shine. Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side. Before we get started, take half a second to subscribe to keep up with the latest news from Waves Audio. We're always dropping valuable mixing tricks and tips from the industry's top producers and engineers. All right, now let's dig in with plugin number one. The number one must-have for Ableton Live is the J37 Tape Plugin. Reel-to-reel -reel tape emulation. It has so many tape saturation settings. The wow, the flutter, the built-in delay. A definite upgrade if you're looking for an analog tape plugin, and you can get a retro warmth to any track or mix bus. We can give keys a more saturated and vintage vibe. We can make synth sounds a little more wavy and lo-fi. It works amazing for saturating and adding character to drums. Heats up vocals by adding a vintage warmth. Ah, uh, I'm finna blow. You don't even know. They try to impose. I leave them exposed. Heart covered in gold. Like, watch for my soul. Learn along the road. Well, the more you know. And then we can add in the built in delay. Ah, uh, I'm finna blow. You don't even know. They try to impose. I leave them exposed. We get a nice depth with the slapback. All right. Here's the same four tracks together in Bypass. I am in a blow, you don't even know. They try to impose, I leave them exposed. And now with J37. I am in a blow, you don't even know. They try to impose, I leave them exposed. If you're looking for vintage warmth, the sound of analog tape, you can go subtle or as creative as you need. And it's got a ton of presets built in for just about anything. Definitely check this plugin out. Now let's move on to plugin number two. Number two is the Waves Tune Vocal Pitch Correction Plugin. Really easy and fast to get precise and adjust the pitch on vocals, no matter how extreme the case. Let's check out how it works. I'm gonna open it up on the vocal track. Now it's gonna scan the raw vocal in real time, right along with the music. Life been moving fast, had to go get off my ass, yeah. Had to have a plan, make this year better than last year. So we've got the vocals laid out. Now you can use the keyboard here on the left for reference tones. All you need to do is select the parts you want to adjust. I'm just going to speed up the process and place them on the desired notes. Life been moving fast, had to go get off my ass, yeah. All right, on to the next phrase. Just going to speed this up. Let's hear it back. Had to have a plan, make this year better than last year. Now, once you set the notes to the correct pitch, you can adjust the transparency of the correction with the speed and note transition controls. Life been moving fast, had to go get off my ass, yeah. Had to have a plan, make this year better than last year. Life been moving fast, had to go get off my ass, yeah. Had to have a plan, make this year better than last year. Now, you can set these to make the correction as subtle or robotic as you want. This plugin is also great if you're stacking vocal harmonies. It just keeps everything sounding tighter across tracks. So I went ahead and adjusted these vocals. Let's listen to the before and after with the music. Here's the before. I'm sorry that I miss you, but I'm really out here. For the ride. Yeah. And after. I'm sorry that I miss you, but I'm really out here. For the ride. Yeah. A must have if you work on vocals in Ableton. The number three plugin is another must have for vocals. So let's check it out. The number three plugin is Sibilance. If you're working on vocals, you need a good de -esser. This one is the most transparent out there due to the organic resynthesis under the hood. It removes any harsh S sounds without having to sweep or look for it, and you get more natural sounding results. Take a listen to this part of the vocal. Lucy in the sky with diamond sunlight make it shine. 
Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side. The plugin automatically picks up all the harsh areas. Let's turn on the monitor and bring the range down to hear only the harshness in the vocal that we're going to treat. Let's turn off the monitor. Now bring the threshold down to set the amount of reduction of the sibilance. Lucy in the sky with diamond sunlight make it shine. Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side. Lucy in the sky with diamond sunlight make it shine. Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side. Now you can definitely get more surgical and fine tune with the detection and mode controls. Overall, you get a super fast, easy to use, and super clean de -esser, saving you time so you can get to other things in the mix. Now, if you haven't already, definitely demo this one and hear instantly why it's the go to for so many top engineers and producers. Let's move on to the next must have for Ableton Live. The number four plugin is another time saver, Bass Rider. Now, one thing we do during the final mix stage is ride the bass throughout the mix. Or sometimes we'll go back and edit individual clip gains, trying to fix uneven bass levels. Bass Rider does all that for you. Take a listen to this bass line. Now you can hear and see the difference in volume between the glide up and the root note. So to keep it consistent, I'm going to slide over the target area right between the lowest and loudest notes. Now if the louder notes get over attenuated, just slide the range up to prevent over reduction. Now if the softer notes get too loud, just bring the range here at the top down to reduce the overcompensation. Now, unlike using a compressor, Bass Rider doesn't affect the waveform shape or the transients. It moves the fader along according to the intensity of the bass, keeping the bass sounding nice and smooth without the side effects you might get with a compressor, saving you time in the mix. The fifth must-have plugin for Ableton Live is the Abbey Road EMI TG Mastering Chain. This mastering suite is modeled after the original EMI TG12410 transfer console from Abbey Road's Mastering Rooms. Now, this plugin gives you the modular mastering tools for input level, phase, and tone shaping. EQ. All the modules can be processed in either stereo, duo, or mid-side. Clicking this right here will expand each module for more controls. You get three different compressor limiter types. Stereo spread enhancement. Everything you need for a warm, loud, and wide mix in one plugin. To me, one of the best parts about this plugin are the presets. And using the preset browser, we can type in what we're looking for and audition it on the mix in real time. You can use this plugin on the master bus or groups or even individual tracks to give them that console sound. Let's take one more listen to the before and after of just the TG mastering chain. Here's the before. Truthfully, there's still a lot of hope for me. Stay up like I'm supposed to be. And after. Truthfully, there's still a lot of hope for me. 
over for me Stay up like I'm supposed to be there you go, five essential sound tools to add to your Ableton Live arsenal. But that's only five plugins to complement Ableton. Waves has got a whole lot more, so definitely head over to waves.com slash Ableton to learn more. There's also a link in the description below to all the plugins shown in this video. And to keep up with the latest news, tips, tricks, and more from Waves Audio, hit that subscribe button. And until next time, thank you for watching. Rolling, 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 oh so much it hurt my side Smoke a little